Brazil is a bustling hub of economic activity and trade, and understanding its complexities is essential to any global investment strategy. In this video, I'll explore the fundamentals of Brazil's economy. Welcome to Simply Economics. Subscribe to this channel and you'll get the most amazing and informative videos all the time. With its thriving agricultural sector and extensive network of international trade connections, Brazil is a prominent power in South America. In this video, we'll discuss the history of Brazilian economics, as well as its recent developments in trade and industry. I'll also address potential problems that could affect the economy going forward. So, let's get going. The Economy of Brazil Brazil is a powerhouse in mining, agriculture, and manufacturing, with a robust and rapidly growing service sector. It stands as a leading global producer of various minerals, including iron ore, tin, bauxite, aluminum ore, manganese, gold, quartz, diamonds, and other precious gems. Additionally, Brazil exports significant quantities of steel, automobiles, electronics, and consumer goods. Brazil is renowned for being the world's leading producer of coffee, oranges, and cassava. It is also a significant contributor to the sugar, soy, and beef industries. However, Brazilian agriculture has seen a decrease in significance due to urbanization and the exploitation of other resources. Sao Paulo has emerged as a major global hub for industry and commerce, exploring Brazil's economic landscape through its rich history. Brazil's economic history has been characterized by a pattern of booms and busts, driven by heavy reliance on specific agricultural products throughout the centuries. This cycle started with Brazil wood and transitioned to sugar, minerals such as gold and diamonds, coffee and rubber. In the 20th century, the Brazilian government made attempts to diversify the economy by promoting manufacturing and reducing dependence on agricultural exports. During the Great Depression, the Brazilian government implemented nationalistic policies to gain control of key industries, resulting in advancements in shipbuilding, petrochemicals, microelectronics, and aircraft manufacturing. In the late 20th century, high inflation rates posed economic challenges, which were addressed through the introduction of the real plan in the mid-1990s. Brazil later faced economic challenges in the early 21st century due to political uncertainties, inflation, financial instability, and unemployment. Despite progress, inequality and uneven land ownership patterns persisted, leading to ongoing social movements advocating for reforms. Brazil and its abundant resources. Brazil is rich in both renewable and non-renewable resources. Mineral reserves, agriculturally productive land, and other sources of wealth have been exploited in the southeast and south, but other regions are growing in prominence. Improved transportation has made more resources accessible for export or for use by Brazil's industries and growing population. Brazil also has significant offshore reserves of petroleum and natural gas. The country's extensive river systems and plentiful rainfall contribute to its large hydroelectric potential. Forests cover a significant portion of Brazil's land area, and it has access to substantial fishing grounds, although the fishing industry is underdeveloped. Agriculture of Brazil Brazil is a self-sufficient country in terms of food and a major exporter of crops like oranges, soybeans, coffee, and cassava. It leads globally in coffee and soybean production. Brazil also excels in producing oranges, cassava, beans, corn, cacao, bananas, and rice. The country has a significant livestock population and is a major player in the meat and poultry industries. Brazil has made technological advancements in agriculture and is a leading producer of ethanol from sugarcane. Brazil's fishing industry is focused mainly on saltwater catch, with commercial fleets accounting for two-thirds of the total. The Northeast region specializes in lobster and shrimp fishing for export. Freshwater fish, including tilapia, make up a significant portion of Brazil's catch, particularly from the Amazon River system. In terms of forestry, timber production is concentrated in the south and southeast, with eucalyptus trees being the primary source. These plantations are mainly used for cellulose and paper production. Burning of rainforests and wooded areas for agricultural purposes is prevalent, but the timber is rarely used for fuel or wood products. Brazil and its industry Brazil's manufacturing sector sets it apart from other Latin American countries by creating a strong market for primary materials. The country consumes a significant portion of its mineral production, including iron ore, copper, and bauxite. Brazil is self-sufficient in tin ore and is a major producer of gold and diamonds. Manufacturing plays a significant role in Brazil's economy, contributing to its GDP and employment. The southeast region houses the largest and most efficient establishments, while Sao Paulo stands out as a manufacturing hub. 
The country excels in automobile production and also manufactures electrical machinery, chemicals, steel, food products, textiles, and footwear. Brazil's trade and tourism. Foreign trade has played a critical role in the Brazilian economy, with exports gradually contributing more to national income. Efforts to access foreign markets, government financing, and the growth of the ethanol industry have fueled export growth. Tourism is also thriving, with millions of foreign visitors each year. Popular destinations include Uruguay, Argentina, and the United States. Rio de Janeiro, Salvador, and the Amazon region are key attractions. Iguacu Falls and other natural and historic sites continue to draw interest from both foreign and domestic tourists. The Future of Brazil's Economy Brazil's economic prospects are promising as the nation is projected to maintain its trajectory of growth and stability. For sustained success in the long term, it is imperative to persist in endeavors aimed at diversifying the economy. Thanks for watching guys. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of our future content. We truly appreciate your support. See you in the next one.